All right, this video is about bioelectric drops. Okay, these are minerals. Now, the significance of minerals basically in the body is every biological process in the body and in nature requires a mineral to activate it, just like spark plugs in a car. You have to have the mineral to activate it. Now, minerals is are inorganic. They come from volcanic eruptions from deep earth. They were here before we came here. The body does not manufacture them. We have to get them from nature on a daily basis. And um, normally we, we would get them from produce. Now it's a whole big story that our soil has been depleted from very bad uh, habits of, of uh, uh, modern agriculture, um, different types of farming that are inconducive to the um, sustainability of the, of the earth. And therefore, our soil is depleted. And there's a lot more reasons than uh, artificial chemicals and, and, and artificial fertilizers, et cetera, et cetera, depleted the earth from minerals. Therefore, our produce does not contain the minerals that we need. We need 72 minimum a day. And we're getting about three to four from conventional and maybe 15 from organic. So this has 72 to 100 minerals, uh, bioavailable minerals. What does that mean? Minerals that can be absorbed by a living cell. Same format that is existing with plants. Okay, So plants have minerals that a human cell can absorb. Like I said, they don't have enough. This completes the picture. Now, we add three to four drops. This, all, all, this also has um, extract of moringa and an extract of uh, graviola, okay? And these are herbs that have high levels of immune, um, immune protection and immune boosting. In uh, Cuba, they actually use moringa for curing cancer, uh, as well as graviola is used in places like South America for the same purpose. Uh, graviola is also called soursop. Um, three to four drops per cup. Thing is consistency. These minerals, what they would do when you put them in water, any water, any liquid pretty much, coffee, tea, even wine, um, or water of course, uh, consistency. They would do a few things. They would, struct, they would structure the water. They would turn the molecules into to hexagonal shape, making the, ma making the water more hydrating. Water requires minerals in order to perform its role in the body and vice versa. Minerals require water in order to perform their role in the body. Therefore, water with minerals will drive the water better into the cells, meaning that resulting in increased, increased cellular hydration. We've tested this for cellular hydration and increases it by 32%. There's nothing on the market like that, even the most expensive Himalayan salt, salt is minerals. Uh, does not accomplish that. So cellular hydration is huge because the cell requires hydration in order to perform its other roles, um, its various roles in the body. Okay. Increases uh, structures the water, increases cellular hydration. This will purify over 250 contaminants in the water. Okay, we've tested that third 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 party lab tests, uh, which can be provided upon request. 250 contaminants, chlorine, fluoride, bacteria, heavy metals, uh, viruses, um, different types of chemicals, petrochemicals, pharmaceutical chemicals, uh, agricultural chemicals, uh, even types of parasites will uh, neutralize them in the water and it will sink to the bottom. Uh, another thing is, of course, it will add the 72 to 100 minerals. So if you're doing this on a daily basis and adding it to every water, and I want to add it to every water because, first of all, I don't trust the cleanliness of any water that I get. So I have this in my bag anywhere that I go. I add some to any liquid that I consume. That's um, bioelectric drops.